Hey guys, this is Brad with PCMac.com and today we're going to show you how to insert the bootstrap framework into your HTML project. So the first thing you want to do is create a HTML file. Uh, so what I have here is just a basic bootstrap.html file and you can make it as basic as you want. Uh, we're not really going to be going into the uh, content in this video just yet, but just showing you how to uh, get it set up so that we can start going through all of that. So first things first, you'll want to go into your web browser and go to get bootstrap. Get bootstrap.com. So what you can do is you can uh, download it and just insert it into your project. But the easiest way, at least for uh, learning, is to click on this getting started button and use a content delivery network with the links here. Uh, so you'll just want to go through that, copy it, minimize that, and then under your head tag in your HTML file, you'll want to just uh, paste it. And that's and there it is in your uh, HTML file. Uh, you can get rid of uh, this extra stuff if you want. It's really uh, not completely necessary. Whoops. Go over here. Let's get rid of that. Get rid of the second one. And then the third one. You don't have to do this, but it makes uh, it look a bit more uh, clean. There you go. It's uh, in your project and ready to use. Uh, you can see here the uh, comments here um, shows you whoops which ones there. This one is the uh, JavaScript file. Uh, this is an optional theme, and you have the uh, main uh, bootstrap c CSS file here. And yeah, that's all there is to it. Uh, be sure to check out the next video where we will uh, start digging into a lot of the uh, different stuff bootstrap has. Once again, I've been Brad with PCMuck.com, and until next time.